What's up everybody here at home self-isolation style and you know we've talked about OCD with coronavirus we've talked about anxiety with coronavirus I've done a video about ERP with coronavirus but I kind of just wanted to do a quick video today about what are my actual thoughts of, about this whole situation and the county that I'm in has a lot of cases and the county south of us has a lot of cases and it's just making everybody you know really cautious and they're gonna have a town meeting today about whether or not to have a stay-at-home order and my thoughts are pretty simple on this um, you know people are dying um, people are getting sick young people are getting sick old people are getting sick and it's really our duty to help stop this thing and if we all don't play our part and stay at home and take this seriously it's not going to end it's just going to keep growing and there's going to be more life lost so you know i know it's tough and everybody wants to have their opinions and politically they sit on whatever side and that's fine but we're all in this together and and i really want to just put the message out for everybody to, to stay at home right now. Let's get through this together because if we do nothing, nothing happens. So if together we do something, and even if that something is just staying at home for two weeks, then let's do that. Let's make that decision and, and let's get it done and, and move past this because at this point, life isn't normal. So to say sitting at home for a given period of time is going to mess up your finances and mess up your job. Well, our jobs are already messed up. Our finances are already going to be messed up. So we can either try to buck the system and say we're going to go do the things we want to do anyway, or we can take this hardship for what it is and sit at home and start to work past this. So I just want to encourage everybody to, to think about your neighbor, think about the next guy, uh, stay at home. You know, I, I have a daughter inside, and I have to protect her. I have one job in this world that's protect her and her mother, and, and I'm going to do that. So I urge all you to do the same. I'm just a regular guy from Bonita Springs, Florida, telling you guys, man, please, I need all of you to stick together, stick with me on this, stick with each other on this, and, and let's stay home and get past this. Thanks, guys.